I mean, th things can uh, change back, though. But it's irrelevant. I it's think undefinable anyway. How are you going to do? There's no way you can write some law that says, well, you can't have no big business in government no more. I mean, how the fuck are you going to write it? How is somebody going to interpret it? What the fuck is it going to mean? Oh, we public, mean the government... Public the financing. Government. Oh, well, public financing is bullshit. That's the last thing I fucking want. Adobe Flash Players. Fucking pay, fucking pay for fucking pay for goddamn stuff. commercials? Why the fuck would I want to do that? That's Nikki. silly. Because it, yeah, it fixes the problem. It can fix either. the problem. It's not going to fix nothing. Public financing of campaigns is bullshit. Right now, if people want to know what somebody believes, they can find out what they believe. And if the politicians were honest, they'd be right on fucking YouTube. Yeah. They'd be making fucking YouTube videos. If the goddamn politicians had any integrity, they'd be right here in Stickham right now saying, yeah. this is what I believe in, this is what I'm going to defend. But we don't demand that they do any of that shit. So why should I pay for a 20-second commercial, pay, pay CBS and NBC? BC and ABC, bin, bin, millions and millions of dollars, right, for 20 second commercials that just say, look, here's my fake family, here's my beard wife, um, you know, I really go out and fuck men in boys' rooms, you know, well, I fuck boys in men's room, actually, uh, but this is my fake life that I'm going to show to you, so there's my 20 second commercial, I didn't tell you anything about my politics, I didn't tell you anything about what the fuck I'm going to do, and you just paid for me to do nothing, to tell you nothing, but just to show you my fake <laughs> wife him. and my fake fucking kids. Look at that. I know, it's a, it's a system. It's a system. Fuck, look at all these people. So we have to change the system. This Shut is up. the best stick hand night ever. Shut up. Yeah, I'm having the worst night ever. I'm going to fall over. I'm literally going to tip. I'm just going to tip right over. There's something, but the gyroscope inside my head is broken. Up the magic dragon. That'll calm you down. Yeah, well, I need something. <laughs> you know. Uh, insulin. I have to I have to start taking insulin. I'd be cool though, but I can shoot it up. So that'd be fun. Or we could try rubbing our eyebrows together. That would generate a sort of quantum energy field. And I was just too have... fucking. I'm not talking about rubbing nobody's fucking eyebrows. <laughs> it's going way, way in a direction I don't. That's the, like the breast milk thing. I ain't going there. Never again. Madam, um, I think you don't understand that these politicians are all, all concerned about job security, right? That's that's the number one thing, getting real. Oh, they couldn't give so a they fuck. Need... Their job security, no, no, no. They're, they're, it's like Obama. Obama's not thinking about being president. Obama's thinking about, hey, I'm going to make ten million bucks a year as soon as I'm not president anymore. Clinton has made ten million dollars every year he's been out of the presidency. All right. I mean, they got, they've made a hundred million dollars since he stopped being president. I mean, politicians are just looking to feather a nest, and once the nest is built, they don't give a fuck anymore, and they'll they'll keep the job. Because, yeah, it's got nice perks, and you know, they only got to work a couple of months a year, no big fucking deal. But they're not really that panicked about losing their job. But they they compete for uh, camp campaign financing. They compete for money. For uh, advertisements on TV. Yeah, to, now, to get elected. So that's, that's right. That's, because that's, they, that's they, the some of them will even here. spend their own money, which is even wackier. I mean, look at our the, the ex governor of our state spent like fifty million dollars, <laughs> you know, to be governor. Why the fuck would you want to be a governor anyway? It's a shitty job. I mean, it goes from senator to governor. Why the fuck would you leave being a senator to be a stupid fucking governor? I mean, senators. I don't know about that, but you think about Bloomberg. Next to president, senators, the game. I always guessed governors became governors because they wanted to kill people. You know, have power over. You know, um, what's it called? At least, uh, 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 at least Michael get somebody Bloomberg. Somebody out of jail. <laughs> you know, maybe that's it. I want to get my son out of jail. <laughs> yeah. My unnamed bastard son. I think they have a lot of bastard sons. Well, at least my, Michael Bloomberg got secondhand smoke out of uh, New York City. So that's, that's a you. major accomplishment. Fuck you. Fuck what? you. That's a stupid issue.
it's a stupid issue. I'm going, I'm going to give somebody a, I'm going to applaud somebody for getting secondhand smoke in, in, yeah, the, in this fucking state bartenders, where, 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 you know, yeah, yeah, it's stupid. It's fucking idiotic. You know how many carcinogens, if you're walking the streets of New York on the fucking sidewalk, all right? Uh, come, why, why not get a little bit realistic? You could sit in a bar for for a million years, and you probably couldn't consume more carcinogens than you will in five years walking the streets of New York. Uh, well, I, I think like this is sometimes why why people. Yeah, well, they have tested the air quality on on a city street in New York, and it's horrific. It's two packs a day smokers, what they've approximated the amount of particulates alone, just in particulates. All right, the heavy so you, carbon so you think that you're inhaling. Smoking cigarettes next to you is gonna is makes it any better? No, it makes it worse. No, it just makes it fucking irrelevant. Is what it makes it, you dumb fuck, and it just no, makes it's not a huge. In well, why, 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 why is this exposure. your business? No, no, everybody lived with this cigarette thing. People had their fucking they had fires inside their fucking houses. You dumb moron. People uh, live for centuries with Amen. gas flame as their light, okay? Gas flames with black soot flying off of the gas flames. And that's how they lived for hundreds of years. And they weren't all winding around going, I can't breathe, I can't breathe. No, none of that shit happened. Somehow, it wasn't a fucking issue. That doesn't happen until the end. Any happens until the end. Any well, it's just now fucking listen. retarded. I mean, listen. fucking listen. Benjamin Franklin inhaled and ate more goddamn crap, okay, than anybody. And what, he lived to be like fucking 90 years old, you dumb fucktard. Now, you see, you're undoing some good that you could do here on YouTube. I'm at him because Sorry, no, no, I'm not really him. worried. I'm not place. really worried about that. These You're not bullshit, about the, fucking nonsense issues. That's right. Go, go ride a air, yellow submarine somewhere air, else. You're, going, you're leaving now. Air, you're leaving. Get, prepare. The yellow submarine is now departing. Here you go. Boom. <laughs> you fucktard. Goddamn secondhand smoke asshole fuck shit. God, how can people worry about this bullshit? The whole fucking world's going to be nuked in about three and a half years. And this asshole's worried about secondhand fucking smoke. Ugh. Oh. Shit. I guess you don't believe in third hand smoke then either. Yeah, third hand. What is that? Is that it's like pregnant babies or some kind of bullshit? You gave my 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 Jerry my my German eating hamster cancer. That'll be the next lawsuit. Right? No, they oh. say that um cigarette smoke leaves a resin on stuff and that resin combines with other chemicals in the air and that creates cancer. Carcinogens. Well, as long as you don't fucking vacuum, you're not going to have no fucking problem. So just don't do outlaw vacuum cleaners. There. Everybody will be just fine then, okay? If you don't fucking stir the shit up, then you ain't going to fucking die. So just leave it on the ground where it belongs. Leave it on the shelf where it belongs. Don't stir it up. So let's outlaw vacuum cleaners. I'm all for it. But you're right about car exhaust being worse for people because baby strollers are like fucking the, the height of an exhaust pipe. That's that does way more damage to babies than fucking cigarettes do. Yeah, well, it's a, it's a ton of particulates. Like I said, you look at a car exhaust. Okay, I mean that's a that's a lot of exhaling going on there. Lots of exhaling. I mean, I'd have to exhale a lot of times to make as much exhale as a fucking car. All right, and it's really, really a ton of particulates that shoot it. You can see the exhale from a car, and you can smell it from like ten feet away. Don't forget, it's not just cars. There's fucking trucks and buses. Start putting rats in bars and then rats on the street and seeing which ones get more toxins and die quicker. Then we can put this argument to a rest. Yeah, well, I'm sure somebody's done, uh, the, like I said, they, they, they have little things. They can count how many particulates fall into the little boxy thing. So I think it's probably out there. The facts are out there. But they don't give a fuck about the facts. They, they give a fuck about persecuting a fucking minority about this stupid cigarette shit.